Hi, it's me, Josephine, and I'm happy to see you again. So today I'm going to answer a question what I was asked a lot. And I had this question too, and I wish somebody would have told me. It's about pack dolls. If you're studying with pack dolls because you don't want to buy the very expensive brand pack dolls from like Grimm's or all those other brands, or if you just want to start with pack dolls because you think it's very cute how you can design them or whatever is your reason, there are questions you will have. Which shape? Which shape is the best to get? It absolutely depends on what you want to do. I think that this is kind of the worst shape to get. And I wish I wouldn't have bought this shape, but I did. No, I know. <laughs> the reason why is there's not a lot I personally can do with that. I did some things. I mean, the first thing you think when you see the shape is the shape of a woman. And I don't really want to teach my daughter that way that every woman has of this shape and 90, 60, 90 and oh la la. No. <laughs> so this is not really what I want to teach her. And I use this to make things like butterflies and bees really cute. I also used it once for a snowman, also worked out well. But the thing is, when it has wings and you have a little toddler, that's just a very bad combination. Toddlers can be very rough. They are just not as gentle as the kids when they grow older. This is my last favorite because my kid is rough and I can't make a lot of things like this. I think another great idea to do with this especially because Halloween is coming right now. I'm not sure when I will upload the video, but right now it's coming. <laughs> Would be to make a bed. I just got this idea. But anyway, this is my least favorite shape. But maybe you love that shape. I don't know. It's just what I think about the shape and thoughts you might have when you actually bought it. Okay, let's go to this shape. Great for many things, but there are a lot, a lot of, of pictures on Pinterest where you actually need more a shape like this. So you can have this kind of like open and then you can have a design here inside. Like if you want to have for the seasons with numbers or with the weather. With this, it is harder. But if you just want to give them a color and you would like to use them for pack dolls for a board game you're making, then this will work out fine. I also like that they are very tall. I'm sure you can get them smaller too. I, I actually do, but I really love that they are very tall. Yeah, here are some smaller ones. The middle size. But it really depends on what you want to do. Like these, my daughter likes to play, that these little ones, and these are the babies. And like I said, if you want to make it very simple, like I did here, they are great. But if you would like to give them some sort of a design, it would be great if they would have this shape and are not just straight. And if you have a birthday circle, then what I found out is really great to have uh, like the same shape here of these. This is actually the Grimm's one. I just did not buy one with that shape. What I regret because that's really great. <laughs> and this is the only one what I have what has this shape. But it's too small to do things like with, with the season and top and all of that. It's just very small. But if you have pack dolls like this, they actually at least this one fit in inside of the birthday circle and usually they all come from alibaba shop and they are mostly all from the same company made but then but then they are sold by different sellers so you might find this actually very easy and they really fit inside of the birthday circle and those birthday circle figurines are very expensive so if you're into making pack dolls, you might want to do things like this. Then 
it is really great if they fit there. Yes, it is very flat, but it works out well. And I think that this is pretty nice to know. So here I have a part of our birthday circle from the company Grimm's and this really perfectly fits here inside. Of course, if you turn it around, it falls out because this is very short, but if you just want to stick it inside, it fits. Okay, that's all I had to say. I hope this video was a help for you and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. If you want to see more of those videos, hit the notification bell and of course give this video a thumbs up if I could help you in any way to find the right pack dolls for your project. Have a beautiful time. Goodbye. See you next time.